Lee Harder, T and D, with you on this hot June twenty second. Supposed to see record temperatures today. Um, be cautious out there with that. Uh, in the headlines today, big news in uh, Calhoun County and and actually from beyond. Sandy Run uh, dedicated the big spec building at the Sandy Run Industrial Park yesterday. Uh, Calhoun County did so, and uh, stands to be another um, potential. Great news for development in our area. Uh, Orangeburg County is, uh, I guess you'd call it warning that there may be a tax increase coming with its upcoming budget. Uh, they're hoping to mitigate it uh, as much as possible, but uh, uh, we will keep you informed as, as to how that is unfolding. Uh, story today from Martha Rose Brown on the family's devastation and the loss of two cousins. Uh, an incident in the eastern part of the county, both found dead inside their home slain. Uh, we'll be waiting for future developments on that. Good news for Claflin, uh, $500,000 from Bank of America that'll go toward their uh, Center for Social Justice downtown is the base of that. And also the Pathways for Prison, from, from prison program, which uh, basically edu uh, provides education to, to inmates. Uh, you'll want to know that early voting for the runoffs in South Carolina primaries begins today, runs through Friday uh, at the same sites that where, we, where the primary voting was early, early voting for the primaries was held previously. Uh, in our counties, uh, the, there's one, the Democratic uh, runoff for U.S. Senate uh, is, is in play. And, uh, and on the Republican side, there's a runoff on for superintendent of education. There are no local runoff races in Orangeburg, Calhoun, or Bamberg. Post four picked up a win over Hampton last night, uh, despite some struggles. Still in the still in the league mix, and we want to tell you that uh, Teresa Hatchell uh, in her weekly taste column this week is looking at June is Dairy Month and things you can do with. Uh, some pretty cool stuff with dairy. All right. Uh, <laughs> probably cool is a good word for today. So stay that way and uh, check us out at the TND.com. You'll find more than what I've been telling you about. Um, have a good day.